After nearly a year of the aviation demand downturn amid the COVID-19 pandemic, there hasn't been much of a recovery yet, especially for international travel. This has taken a hit on many of the Asian business and financial hubs such as Singapore, where in years prior, the Red Dot played host to events and meetings that would facilitate the growth of businesses in the city and abroad. To help restart this aspect of international travel, Singapore is looking to a new strategy with the recent opening of a new business travel bubble. This new business travel bubble is part of a pilot program at a recently opened facility named Connect at Changi, which is within a 5-minute drive from the Singapore Changi Airport at the Singapore Expo. This new facility is very much a city within a city covering an area of around 72,500 square meters with an in-facility hotel hosting 150 rooms and 40 business meeting rooms, not to mention other amenities such as food and beverages, gyms, and a small area to walk around. This project sounds like just a new building development, but the real travel bubble concept comes in the form in who is allowed to stay in the facility. The audience for this facility is particularly business travelers, officials, and high economic value visitors looking to meet with local counterparts based in Singapore while not having to go through the regular quarantine. Though for the most part, this will be a quarantine facility and during their stay, foreign visitors will be required to take COVID-19 testing. Business travelers can conduct their meetings with their local counterparts, though they cannot go outside the facility. So any trip to visit the Merlion or to go to a hawker center to grab some local cuisine is out of the question. While for the most part, the visitors will be quarantined, the building is designed with separate entrances and ventilation for foreign travelers and Singapore locals. This pilot program is part of an effort of Singapore to jumpstart a part of business travel often referred to as MICE which stands for Meetings, Initiatives, Conferences, and Expos, a major contributor to the overall tourism industry of Singapore. In previous years, often these kind of meetings would take place downtown, and expos usually at the Singapore Expo or other facilities such as the Marina Sands or the Suntech Convention Center. These facilities plus the location of Singapore being a seven-hour flight from major cities around the world and Asia makes it a top destination for the mice industry which indirectly is a boost to Singapore Changi Airport and the airline serving Singapore. This is the first of any kind of project like this in the world that would allow those traveling for business to attend a meeting in Singapore and do actual face-to-face -face meetings with their counterparts, which for the majority of last year has been relegated to using online applications such as Zoom. The incentive is there now for Singapore to be again a host of these kind of meetings, especially adding convenience for business travelers on a short-term visit and stay within the facility. It is very much a short-term solution for the time being, especially with the current global travel restrictions in place. But more importantly, it is an indirect way to allow the airlines like Singapore Airlines to allow more bookings on their flights bound to Singapore. Though down the road in the future, the Singapore government will likely want to ease restrictions to allow much more travel and in return more commerce to take place. What are your thoughts on Singapore's current pilot project for a business travel bubble at the Connect Changi facility? I definitely would love to hear your take on this. In the meantime, I definitely hope you enjoyed this short video. If you liked it, please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Thanks again for watching and have a great day.